Yeah, and he's going to get the run back against the guy whose VODs he studied. Because he was, true. He's, he studied, as far as I know, two VODs. He studied, him and I worked together with when our VOD, me and him. Oh. And then Merc and Lewis worked together in Merc set versus Trial. Oh, wow. Sick. Yeah, yeah. So, Merc is like actually on the improvement train, which is hype. Cool. He said today would be a good mentality day as well. So. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So, we're going to get to see if he uh, implements some things. I'll try and give some good advice, too, because I know probably who we're doing. Um, yeah, we're we're going to have, gonna have the bias commentary being yeah. like, <laughs> well, Merc, you should have done this and this and right, this, and right. uh, Tribe, I don't know. Yeah, who knows, dude. <laughs> so, I am completely lost in this matchup, Falcon okay. side, as to what is, he is supposed to be trying to do, specifically against Tribe's type of Falco that is so hell-bent on whiff punishing yeah, and controlling yeah, yeah. space with the laser. Because um, in my head, right, you would want to ju like jump over the lasers, try to use your platforms, and get a knockdown with Stomp or Nair or something. But right. it seems like... Anytime you're trying to do that aggression, he gets this laser immediate turnaround up tilt and then just combos you basically to death. Right. No, it's for sure tough. Okay. Well, okay, so that's down. like a good thing. Uh, you want to, if, if he touches your shield, you have to recognize if you can stomp. Oh my god. Hold on. All right. Okay, laser reset just walks yeah. back. Damn, look at that pressure. shine pressure. Yeah, man. for real. It's like, what? If Falcon really, he has to roll, right? Yeah. He has, yeah. like, there are some spacings where you can stomp out of shield or do like an aerial out of shield. Falcon is like the only character to this day where when he gets shield pressure, even at top level, like Wizrobe is playing, he will still just roll out of shield. You have shield drop up yeah. air on a platform sometimes. Yeah. But, uh. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, okay. I guess the read though. Yep. Nice. Weak nice. Nice. Yeah. So, you basically have to do that. You have right. to just convert off of all your punishes. Which obviously easier said than done. Oh, nice back air though. Yeah, a little yeah, yeah, yeah. And Tribe is making it hard, man. Oh yeah. Cause like, he's just if he's just playing safe. He's so good at mixing bug. up his timings too on shield. Like he'll throw in a jab there, and then he'll put yeah. it out a late nair catching the roll or the jump right. or dash out of shield or whatever. Right, right. Oh. And like that's that is. Yeah, I think he I think he tried. He had a shield drop out, but the shine caught it. Yeah, well, because that were... Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Reads the jump second hit right. there. Yeah, yeah. Tribe has died below 70%, I think, both stocks. Yeah, which is how this matchup goes. Keeping it close. Yeah. The weak knee is great, because that, that'll that beat Phantasm almost all the time, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Ooh. Gets interrupted by the laser. Yeah, yeah. Messes up his timing on the, the wave land. So, in that situation where Falco is above you, it's a lot safer to go for up air than it is for Nair there. Um, because it's just going to contest, like, the space above you better. And, okay, I think I've, <laughs> I think I've solved this matchup. Oh, do tell. I think you just have to spam knockdown. Spam things that get them into knockdown, and then just convert off of it all the time. Yeah. And then you win. Yeah. I figured it out. Awesome. Yeah. We should tell him to do that. <laughs> yeah. So, I've met Merc maybe three times in my life. Yeah. And really? They were all within the past month, so. That's crazy. What's Merc's play style like? What kind of Falcon is he? Um, he... He likes to hit things. He likes to hit things. He likes to he's go not, for reads. He's not a tech chase. He's not, not a tech chase. Not a... More of a... I don't know if this is Reed with fair some. to say, because I don't think he actually plays like him, but closer to a nun than a wizzy. Yeah. Yeah. I know exactly he what He doesn't do the nun things, but... Right. Uh, maybe closer to an S2J than a wizzy. Yeah, Would I think better. that's fair. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I like the Dreamland pick, actually. More space, I think, was really good. Um... I really liked, Merc just did like, he, there, he's, he's spacing around lasers now that he has more space a little bit better. Like twice now I've seen him short hop over a low laser and go for Nair or I think he went for like knee a second ago. Nice, that's good too. Yeah. It is rough on like these knockdown situations. Okay. If you are just a hair late, you're yeah. getting like full combo. No, for sure, for sure. Okay, I like the patience. Edge grab. Ooh, good this fit. Is yeah, yeah. Will work a second time, though. Ooh, okay. Nice oh. jab, yup. Uh, tries for the weak uh, name. I think that's... Yeah, I'm not I, sure. May, maybe back hitbox stomp is technically better. Yeah, true, true, true. 
Okay. That's hard. That was hard. I, yeah. That was ambiguous whether or not he would uh, get to it. Right, right, right. And unfortunately, he has the long getup. So oh, no jump to. This is going to be a meaty punish. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't get the target. He's at 71, dude. Holy moly. Rolls back to center. Mm -hmm. Yeah, gets it this time. Catches the fade back. Oh, that was a call out of an upsell. Yeah. That was not good. Okay, yeah, nice catches him at the corner. It feels like you really just have to abuse your ground speed and mobility in this matchup because it kind of just wins everything else, right? He has better, like, stuffing ground moves. Laser's going to be better zone control than, like, most of the buttons that you're putting out. Yeah. Um, honestly, what do you say the edge guardian is? It feels pretty even, honestly. Yeah, I think there's, like, a good flow chart for Falcon. Um, although I'm not sure. Oh. That is just important. I feel like it's harder for Falco to maybe kill him at, like, get the gimp per sense, right? Because you can yeah. jump out at, a, like, a lot of the weaker, like, down airs, or the down smash isn't quite going to get it. But um, when you're off stage and you eat the jump, you know, it's yeah. pretty simple. Right, so, right. This is best of five, right? Yes. I think so. Okay. Back air. Ooh, doesn't get. I thought that would be back air. Yeah. That would be a nun. That would be a nun thing. Right, right, right. Johnny. Nice. Okay. Johnny, Johnny would just take the name. Yeah. I think you should, um, just for future reference, Murky Gunner watching this, if you go for that weak knee to hit side B, you should up air afterwards. Because that way they get sent away. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. That's Stocks what are we even. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The drop zones. I'm about to see. Hold on. We need a Johnny stock, actually. Talking about S an S2J esque Falcon. Yeah. We are in need of a Johnny stock. Because right, like, Falco can't quite get those stocks, right? Where you're yeah. just literally killing him off the first hit off stage. Right. Ah. Uh, That's going to take it. So where does it go? Okay. Um, you think Merc just stuck with Dreamland? I think Dreamland was working out well for him. Because what he was doing different in that game is he was using space to, to get around lasers and to just like set up aerials in safer ways. So, the Dreamland, going back to Dreamland makes sense. He's smiling, he's having a good time, the mental's positive. Yeah, positive mental. Oh, he, he was telling me lasers. he was kind of um, resigned to eat the lasers in order to get in and get the space. Right. I, I feel like, when, when I saw this um, match, I forget who, it might have been it might have been Aklo that was doing it versus Falco. It would that would make sense. But someone oh no, it was Snu actually. Mm -hmm. It was Snu who was just power shooting like a madman against Falco and just like turned the matchup on its head, like how I feel like it's well. Like if if you can get a majority of your power shields off in this matchup, like it feels like it just changes the pace of it. So yeah, much. for sure. The thing about sure. Snoo though is that he plays Marth, so yeah, you can do the crouch power shield, which makes it like a four for window, I think. Oh, right, really? right, right. Which is I don't, way I don't know about that. Yeah. Yeah. And no, okay, fine. Tribe just gonna throw that one away with yeah. the laser out to the Nether. Delauer, when you said that at first, I thought <laughs> I took that as like the most like new school slippy kid. Like, oh, yeah. he plays Marth, so like Marth, it's just, you know, <laughs> just ninety ten, you know, yeah, just how it is. But um. Yeah, I think um, something that uh, I think uh, Vortex, shout out to Vortex, told me about the Sheik Fox matchup is that like if you don't get grabs and punish game, you just lose. And I think uh, that's oh okay. See, like right there, that's sort of like the vibe I get from this matchup too. Because if Falcon doesn't get his punish game, he just loses. Because he loses neutral. He at best goes even with the edge guards. You can make the case that he goes worse. And like a lot of times, Merc is going off of a launcher for like stomp when he could have gotten a knee and set up for an edge guard, or like there he got a knockdown and he went for a read immediately. He gets them sometimes to his credit. Of course. Yeah, it like, feels like he's playing like it. almost like rock paper scissors kind of, or not rock yeah. paper scissors, but he's just like throwing a dice almost from yeah, where he's going to roll. Right. And if he gets the knee, then he just goes up. But if he doesn't get the knee, he just, just loses. He just yeah you know, loses the first two games and stuff. So, but yeah. That being said, he's in the lead. Um, trying to make it go to a game three. Is that gonna kill? Okay. A little, a little change, a little pocket change off of that nair. So you, would you like to see rather just like the try to reaction tech chase rather than just going for the nair? Yeah, I think 
he doesn't even have to react and tech chase with grab per se, but there are certain situations where you can recognize you have a knockdown and position yourself a little closer to Falco. Oh, the knee? Yeah. Get it again. That's D-I-N. But like, so in, there was a situation there where he got a back. And Falco DI'd away, but not enough to go off stage. So he was still going to tech on stage, and Merc went for stomp in center stage. And what you want to do is get a little closer to Falco, and then try and react to what... Oh, hold on. That was a beautiful a single hit Nair grab, and then reads the tech in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, you want to get a little closer, and try and like, react to what option he does. You can do it with an aerial, or you can do it with a grab. Tribe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tribe getting a fatty combo right now. Wish he reacts to that uh, tech out. Ooh, yeah, and yeah, so Mark got rough. the first hit there, got the knockdown, got the knee, but yeah, just can't quite convert it. Does it here? Hopefully. This is actually a top. Yeah. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. That's the knock. <laughs> I that was none was the first Falcon I saw do that that type of thing where you react to where they're going off. God, just the laser pressure making it so hard on FD. He doesn't have a platform to run away to. Yeah, it's tough, dude. It is tough. This is where the power oh. shielding just seems like necessary. Yeah. And see, like, right there, Merc got a jab reset and he jumped, which is already committing him to cover one, maybe two options. It'll cover tech in place. It won't cover tech in in that situation, and I don't think it would have covered tech away. Like, he didn't have the good drift on the jump, so. Oh, we're tech. Wow, I'm really surprised it caught that. Actually. I didn't think I would hit him because he was no. going backwards, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Poor Falcon. Okay, rolls in. Yeah, Tribe just making this so hard. Playing so well, honestly. Side was under the laser. That is picks some, up the stuff. Yeah, that is some Z-axis stuff. I don't remember how it works, but That's you can crazy. like sometimes Z-axis through lasers with side B. Some soul bad guy action. Yeah, he was, he was getting hit by that laser otherwise, right? That was like yep. a Z-axis. Yeah. Yeah, I'm almost positive. Oh. Okay. Yeah, nice recognition. He didn't go for Merc didn't go for like an aerial there because he recognized that Tri was gonna go for an up tilt. Oh. Oh. Okay. Merc just like dashing back out. Yeah, of no, I like this. Is, uh, this is some footsies right now. Tribe is being good on. Uh, he's doing a lot of these jab checks to check the dash. Ooh. Hold okay. up. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That should be this it. Okay. Bringing it back on the FD counter pick. It was looking really, really hard, but. Yeah, yeah. And now any percent is gonna help. But Tribe looking to close this out. Just go to last stop. Okay. Let's see what we got. Okay. Oh, we got some reads. We okay. got some reads. Double laser. Full punishes it. Oh, almost, so almost. close. Almost, almost. And now this is rough. <gasps> Just what? gets the he side beam. Side he hasn't used this his entire no! time. No! Okay. Oh, what? what? Oh, my God. <laughs> that was like a shield folk side V2. He literally did not, you're right, Delau, he did not side V like the entire set. Yeah. I, I, I actually <laughs> thought, I actually set. thought he dropped that too with the turn. I know. Oh, I thought he messed Lord. that. Oh, my goodness. All right. So now we got a game five. Probably peaked on the mic screen. Yeah. <laughs> sorry, Jerry. We probably clipped the audio real quick, but. And we're going. Okay, nice. good, good. And we're going back to FD. Raw knee out of shield. Okay. I'm definitely starting to notice that what you were mentioning earlier, Taylor, that he kind of just... Merc, he almost plays like a psycho sometimes, where he'll just <laughs> try and read them with a stomp. And yes. Times yeah, where he could just yeah. easily react to something. Very old school. Right, for sure. Yeah, like right there, he tried to read spot dodge, right? Yeah. And I don't think Tribe is really spot dodged. It's like Merc has these... Merc has this deck of options he's looking for. And... Sometimes the cards that he pulls from that deck changes based on what Tribe does, but other times there's just always constants. These Again. side bees under the lasers are just yeah. working. That one was a smart one, though, because he like read, I believe, some sort of, like, I don't know. He read something there. Like. I think he read that like Tribe was going to wait before I mean, I mean, it's, yeah, yeah. it's not like, if you know he's committing a laser, okay. right, it's like the, option, the options are you're going to get hit by the laser and the side B is going to get interrupted anyway so you got hit right. by a laser you know whatever you get under it and hit him yeah. which is insane for you mm -hmm. or you're too far away and it was just a bad side B to begin with and he's going to be able he's going to be actionable by the time the laser's done yeah oh that sucks Merc got that read there but okay nice narrow over the lasers oh just do something? Not that. <laughs> so I guess. Drop down weak neither? I was gonna say refresh invincibility and then like rising aerial to come up with the up B or something. Okay. 
To be honest, I'm not entirely sure. Oh, he again? Does, no way he does it again. <laughs> nice. Again. He yeah. Just... He pulls the the, uh, the read-in card from this deck he has. <laughs> I don't oh. know. So I don't know the exact philosophy. You, you think that's not worth compared to, like, just getting, quote-unquote, the guaranteed grab and just refreshing, like, get him off stage? The thing is, it's not worth because the risk-reward... At least against this, you know, against Tribe is not worth it. Because okay. Tribe hasn't, like, rolled in all the time to always go for it. Tribe has been mixing it up a lot. And so you can, like, react. Yeah, again, like, right there. <laughs> so if you're going to, you can still, like, try and punish with an aerial off of that. Like, but you should stay grounded. Oh, wait a second. Hold so on. Like then Merc sometimes gets this, and I feel like it just reinforces but what it's he's like already there, yeah, right. there I would definitely want to see like a reaction type. Like, I don't hate the higher percent ones Whoa. where it's like, you're getting this hit, you're getting this read, this 50-50, maybe this 33, um, and you're killing, right? Yeah. Another side beat knee. Like, he's just getting so much mileage. And he, like, this is Tribe's last night. All of a yeah. sudden, like, this is looking dominating for Tribe, and Merc just, <laughs> with the side beat technology, is doing this, it. Yeah, these past um, two games... But yeah, I think that throw at 14, I definitely want to see the reaction tech trace, because if you're getting the near the stomp, you're not finishing the stock off that, right? Yeah, yeah. I don't hate usually. them I don't hate them at 40. Right. I don't I feel them. that, I feel it. Okay. okay. Try to turn it up the gas. Yeah. Okay, I like Oh Wow, actually drops it. That's eh, a big five well, percent. Yeah. No, no. <laughs> I think it's been zero zero for every single stock this game. I know. Yeah. Okay, so now we got last stock. Let's see. Let's see who's gonna take it home. Game five this is the side. gentleman. Not a big punish, though. Yeah, yeah, Two yeah. lasers. Give up some center. Okay. I think Merc just wants percent so he can start doing side B. I <laughs> genuinely think it's Honestly, yeah, once, that could be facts. Once you are not able to crouch cancel side B, I will <gasps> be doing it. He gets an air grab, though. Okay. Yep, <laughs> yeah. yep, yep, yep. He's, he's figured out his tool. I don't think this is something that's going to work in, like future sets, <gasps> but, but it might now. get him the win right now. <laughs> Dude, oh my god, my heart is racing. Tribe, oh, Tribe is trying to claw back. Oh no, wait, he's in the lead, what am I talking about? <laughs> oh? I mean, it's dead even, like, any any of these hits can just be the last hit. Yeah, for real. Okay, oh my god, he's getting out of these tech situations. With these Tribe's rolls. getting so much more momentum every oh, time but he like some double this rolls, just and it. Yeah, he's gonna catch hit. Fade back. Great showing nice. from Merkrow. Yeah, for real. That's a super good set. Whew.